Hello everyone, this is me, Safia here, and I'm back with the first week of uh, March read, start from the 1st through the 7th of March 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of Leo, so Leo, let's see what is coming in for you for this week time. I will be adding Oracle Guidance and other cards as well, so stay tuned, and before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it is a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see what is coming in for you for this week time. Leo, let's begin. Two pentacles. Three of Cups, Knight of Pentacles, The Judgment, The Sun, underneath the deck, we do have the Emperor. Wow. You're stuck in a situation where you have to make a choice, make a decision. Uh, this decision is something really major for majority of you. It can be about relocation, it can be about settling somewhere else where from where you are living right now. It can be joining the job outside of, you know, the same country or city or whatever. But it is going to be a major decision of your life uh, that you are going to be taking during this uh, uh, week time. And I feel like, you know, you know one thing for sure, that whatever decision that you are taking, it's definitely going to impact your life overall. Nothing will be the same anymore. So I really feel like, you know, for the majority of you, it has to do with relocation, you know, of some kind. Even if you are getting married, you are going to travel away from wherever you are living right now, which could also be a kind of like, you know, concern for some of you, whether to accept this proposal, because there will be some sort of a cultural differences or something as well when, when it comes to where you are right now and where you will be going after that decision. But I really feel like, you know, you will be very happy. I really see that it is going to be a beautiful change for majority of you. So even if it's a love offer, which is kind of like, you know, going to impact your life that way, if you accept it, go ahead, do that. Stop like overthinking about it. Stop overanalyzing situations. I really feel like, you know, whatever it is that is coming your way uh, during this week time, I feel like, you know, for majority of you, you already have that kind of like, you know, um, offer uh, with you. It's just about you taking that decision. It's just about you making the choice that, okay, fine, I'm going to go for that or not. That is going to bring you the happiness that you want. And I feel like, you know, for the majority of you, even though you are concerned, even though you are indecisive, you know that grabbing the offer is going to work out so well for you. So you have that, like, you know, clarity around it. But at the same time, you do have your concerns. For some of you, probably you will have to travel away from your family, which could also be the that's something which is kind of like, you know, um, making you feel kind of uh, unsure. But ultimately, you are going to make that choice. I feel like, you know, for some of you, probably this decision is something that has been pending for quite some time. And when you take this decision, you will see, you know, a lot of uh, reasons to celebrate your life for. So I really see that this week is going to be the time when a lot of things are going to happen for you major shifts are going to come for you as after you take that decision of yours so if, for some of you you might be signing a contract or something maybe a new job or something like that as well but again it involves something to do with cutting ties from one thing and moving forward moving on so i really see you doing that i really see you accepting that and moving forward with your life i really feel like in for some of you um it can be very well a love offer it can be very well a love offer, which is going to, you know, as you accept this offer, you are going to be, you know, uh, moving forward with, hold on. So yeah, I had to answer that call. Um, so coming back to this, uh, you know, energy, I really feel like, you know, this for majority of you, it is going to be a love offer that is coming your way. It can be coming from a distant land. And as you accept this offer, you know, your life is going to change for better. You are going to relocate because of that. Uh, this, this offer could be coming from the same person that you wanted. It can be somebody from, you know, from the past. It can be somebody that you have been dealing with, but I really feel like, you know, this offer, I, I feel like, you know, for the majority of you, because you're resistant towards accepting this offer, uh, probably it's not going to be somebody from, from, you know, somebody who you wanted. It can be somebody else, but maybe somebody good as well. 
Um, but at the same time, you know that, you know, if you accept this offer, um, your life is going to be changed. So I really feel like, you know, for the majority of you, you are going to take that offer. Initially, you are going to be confused. Maybe you already have this offer. You are taking your time to decide. But I feel like, yes, you are going to decide. Um, and uh, the answer is going to be a yes from your side or vice versa. If the energies are reversed, if you made an offer to a person, they are going to say yes to you in this week time. And then your life is going to change. Probably I see you getting married to this person and relocating with them as well. So I really see that major shift happening here. Underneath the deck, like I said earlier, we do have the Emperor card. So it can be somebody who is mature, who is ready to give in to the connection, who is ready to settle down, who is ready to build a home life with you. And I really feel like, you know, it's exactly how you wanted your life to be. You know, that's what is panning out for you in your life in this week time. So I really feel like, you know, this person is definitely coming in your life. Now, I really feel like, you know, for some of you, probably this person took ages to come to you. It can be in, in, in the sense like... Uh, you know, you have been praying for this kind of life. It can be that. For some of you, maybe it is the same person that you wanted <clears throat> for years. And now this person is like, you know, finally, you know, showing up in your life with, with an offer to make. So it can be that for some of you as well. But I really see beautiful changes coming up for you in your love life during this week time. Let's see some oracle guidance here. Let's see what else is coming in. What else is coming in for you in your love life or otherwise as well for this week time. What is the oracle guidance for you? What is the oracle guidance for you? <clears throat> what is the oracle guidance for you time to play make time to dance and play i feel like you know it's time for you to um stop stressing about anything and the divine really wants you to kind of like you know as you wait while you wait make sure that you're keeping yourself happy positive and try to relax try not to stress about anything it's time for you to enjoy your life it's time for you to you know just go with the flow it's time for you to enjoy the blessings that you are you know about to receive and i feel like you know if this offer has not come yet it is going to come in this week time and you know things might get delayed for for some of you like you know the the, the offer that you're going to accept might be accepting you might be accepting accepting it in the you know next week of the, the march time but i really see this offer is definitely coming in for some of you yes you are going to make that choice for others of you um you know it can be for some of you probably it's the choice of you making a choice that um you know you want to move on with your life you know it can be that choice as well for some of you um rather than being stuck on a specific someone it can be that choice too but whatever that is i really feel like you know you're choosing the right thing and your life is going to move ahead Finally, like, you know, after being stagnant for years, maybe your life is moving forward. So try to enjoy your life. Do not be frustrated. Um, let go and feel peaceful. I really feel like, you know, for some of you, you are definitely getting, pro, you know, kind of uh, frustrated for not getting what you want, what you're supposed to pick someone. And probably that is kind of like, you know, asking you to go for this, uh, you know, the decision that you have to make during this uh, week time. I feel like, you know, it's it's time that you, you need to relax. It's time that you need to kind of like, you know, allow things and changes to come through. Uh, this person is definitely walking into your life, if not this week time. I really feel like in for majority of you, if, if it's not coming in the very beginning of the week time, it is going to come for you in the second half of the week time. So I really don't think that it is this offer is coming late for any of you, but I really see that for some of you, you will be accepting it late probably in the next week time. But this offer is going to come for majority of you. Let's see what else is coming in specifically for you in your love life. Let's take two more cards here about your love life situation in the first week of uh, March time. <clears throat> an offer that you're considering and you know this offer is going to be balanced and it is going to bring a lot of peace and happiness to your life letting go of the stress that you might have taken and starting a new chapter uh all over again uh in terms of your love life i really feel like you know it's it's like um this this offer seems to be exactly how you wanted your your life to be like so i really don't think that you know you need to think or give it a second thought even but if you are still stressed out or frustrated take um you know try take time to kind of like you know uh, relax your mind so you don't have anything to worry about uh, so you could get rid of the stress that you are taking around your love life right now so let's take uh, one more oracle guidance here for you for this week time separation time apart from your partner is on the horizon i feel like you know for some of you yes you might be choosing to move on with a new person 
and parting ways from this person whoever it is that you are been waiting for uh because i really feel like you know it's it's something that is coming to an end which is going to let you have a new beginning which is going to be fulfilling so for some of you moving past a relationship uh which was toxic which was not moving ahead could be the case for some of you but the change that i see coming in is very uh, beautiful so that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read if it was it helped do like, share, and subscribe till I do the next read for you guys. Take care. Bye.